Dupuytren's disease is a disease of the fascia. Underneath our skin, we have a layer of tissue called fascia, which protects all the underlying blood vessels, tendons, and nerves. Some people get disease of that tissue. First, you get a little nodule. With time, the nodule gets bigger, starts forming a cord. Over time, the cord starts contracting and starts bending and pulling your finger down. You see it much more commonly in men than in women, about a seven-one ratio. Usually found in people of Northern European, English, Irish descent, and again, a very strong familial predisposition. And a good rule of thumb is when your finger starts bending and you can't place it flat on a table, or as soon as this joint starts bending, and then we usually recommend taking care of it. We get much better results if we take care of it sooner rather than later. As the disease progresses, Dupuytren's in general does not hurt. If it doesn't bother you, you don't need to do anything for this. But oftentimes, as the finger starts bending, it starts affecting people's quality of life. They can't put their gloves on. They couldn't put their hands in their pocket. Difficult to shake people's hands. So once it starts affecting people's quality of life or the things they enjoy doing and want to do, then oftentimes we take care of it. I think the simplest, best option is using an enzyme. It's a collagenase enzyme. And we use that enzyme to dissolve the collagen. And I inject it in a number of different spots. And in my hands, it's much simpler, easier, less expensive. And the rehab is much quicker and the results are much better than surgery. Because this is a disease, there's a very high risk for reoccurrence. With the enzyme, if this disease recurs, you can just inject it again. If you have surgery and it comes back, it's really difficult to operate a second or third time because of all the scarring that's associated. Everyone who needs treatment can be safely, effectively treated with this enzyme with results that are as good or better than surgical treatment.